Experiment number 28. Examination of the properties of carboxylic acids. The main objective of this experiment is to observe the chemical properties of carboxylic acids. The chemicals and equipment that are required to carry out this experiment are hot plate, test tubes, measuring cylinder, dropper, spatula, glass rod, beaker, distilled water, concentrated sulfuric acid, ethanol, ammonical silver nitrate, acidified potassium permanganate, sodium bicarbonate solution, sodium carbonate solution, sodium hydroxide solution, benzoic acid, ethanoic acid and methanoic acid. At first, we are going to perform all the experiments to ethanoic acid. For that, measure about 2 milliliters of ethanoic acid to 6 separate test tubes. To carry out the first experiment, mix the carboxylic acid with 1 ml of distilled water and check whether it is miscible in water. A clear solution can be observed. To carry out the second experiment, Add about 2 milliliters of sodium hydroxide solution to the test tube containing the carboxylic acid and check whether a clear solution is observed. Here a clear solution can be observed. To carry out the third experiment, add to a solution of sodium carbonate and observe the evolution of gas bubbles. Evolution of gas bubbles was observed. To carry out the fourth experiment, add about 1 ml of ethanol to the carboxylic acid and then add a few drops of concentrated sulfuric acid and heat gently for about one minute. After one minute, pour the mixture to an aqueous solution of sodium bicarbonate and note the order. Water or sodium bicarbonate solution can be used for this. When sodium bicarbonate is used, a salt is formed Therefore, we can avoid the mixing of the odor of the ester formed with the odor present in the acid naturally. To carry out the fifth experiment, add acidified potassium permanganate and observe whether a color change occurs. No color change is observed. 
to carry out the sixth experiment add about 2 milliliters of ammonical silver nitrate to the test tube containing the carboxylic acid. Heat it in a water bath for a few minutes and observe whether a silver mirror is formed. Formation of a silver mirror was not observed. All the tests done for ethanoic acid, their observations and their inferences are shown in this table given. As ethanoic acid is aliphatic, it dissolves in water. So a clear solution was observed when the acid was mixed with water. Next, we are going to perform all the experiments to methanoic acid. For that, measure about 2 milliliters of methanoic acid to 6 separate test tubes. To carry out the first experiment, mix the carboxylic acid with 1 ml of water and observe whether it is completely miscible. A clear solution is observed. To carry out the second experiment, mix the carboxylic acid with 2 milliliters of dilute sodium hydroxide solution and observe whether a clear solution is obtained. A clear solution can be seen. When the carboxylic acid is added to a solution of sodium carbonate, evolution of gas bubbles was observed. To carry out the fourth experiment, add about 1 ml of ethanol to the test tube containing the carboxylic acid. Then add few drops of concentrated sulfuric acid. And heat gently for about one minute. Next, pour this mixture into an aqueous solution of sodium bicarbonate in a beaker and note the order. To carry out the fifth experiment, add acidified potassium permanganate and observe whether it occurs. A colorless solution can be seen. To carry out the sixth experiment, Add about 2 milliliters of ammonical silver nitrate and heat it gently for a few minutes.
observe whether a silver mirror is formed. After a few minutes, a silver mirror was observed. All the tests done for methanoic acid, their observations and their inferences are shown in this table given. As methanoic acid is aliphatic, it dissolves in water. So a clear solution was observed when methanoic acid was mixed with water. Next, we are going to perform all the experiments to benzoic acid. To carry out the first experiment, add benzoic acid to a test tube containing water and check whether it is completely miscible in water. A clear solution cannot be observed. To carry out the second experiment, add benzoic acid to a test tube containing dilute sodium hydroxide and observe whether a clear solution is obtained. After benzoic acid is dissolved completely, a clear solution can be seen. To carry out the third experiment, add benzoic acid to a solution of sodium carbonate and observe the evolution of gas bubbles. To carry out the fourth experiment, first add benzoic acid to a test tube containing ethanol and dissolve the solid in ethanol completely. After the solid is dissolved completely, add a few drops of concentrated sulfuric acid and heat the mixture gently for about 1 minute. After 1 minute, take out the mixture and pour this mixture into an aqueous solution of sodium bicarbonate in a beaker and note down the order. To carry out the fifth experiment, add benzoic acid to a solution of acidified potassium permanganate. Observe whether a color change occurs.
a color change is not observed. To carry out the sixth experiment, add benzoic acid to a test tube containing ammonical silver nitrate. Mix it well using glass rod and heat the sample in a water bath for few minutes. Observe whether a silver mirror is formed. Formation of a silver mirror was not observed. All the tests done for benzoic acid, their observations and their inferences are shown in this table given. Benzoic acid is aromatic. Therefore, it does not dissolve in water. So, a clear solution was not observed. Benzoic acid was mixed with water. 